those are the kinds of things that we need from young people to kind of bring to kind of bring people here and keep people here. Well, at this hour, a city councilman in an Ohio community is hoping free baseball will help keep younger residents from moving. In fact, he's reaching into his own wallet to pay for tickets to an upcoming Cincinnati Reds game. 13 News reporter Lane Ball is in our Huntington studio with who's eligible for the freebies. Lane? Well, the age range is very specific. Only Portsmouth, Ohio residents in their 20s and 30s will receive these free tickets. Now, the goal? To encourage the future generation to stick around. Each year, the Cincinnati Reds host Portsmouth Day at Great American Ballpark. And in the past, community leaders like Plant Portsmouth Jeremy Burnside have thrown out the ceremonial first pitch. While this day has always been a big one for the community, City Councilman Sean Dunn says he wants to get younger residents involved. I thought I'd donate uh, my last two months' salary to buy tickets for people in their 20s and 30s. Dunn is hoping this will act as not just a gift, but also an incentive to get them to stay in the area. The tickets will be evenly distributed to businesses in the downtown area with employees who fall in that age group. Some who would be eligible for the free tickets like the idea. If you've never been to a res game, it's a good experience. <laughs> Someone's going to get excited. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Guys like Sean are really trying to make things happen for us like that and give us things to do and kind of put our community on the map. Dunn says that excitement is exactly what they're looking for. They're also hoping recent city developments will encourage more younger residents to stay. Dunn also says the city is currently shaping the downtown area to be more youth friendly. Portsmouth has developed a dog park in our downtown. We've now got a fully funded skate park that we're, we're getting ready to build. Uh, we've just established a door district. Uh, so there's a lot of things going on now. Now the tickets are for a game in July. If you're interested in learning more about the developments in downtown Portsmouth, you can find those stories on our website, wowktv.com. In the Huntington Newsroom, Lane Ball, 13 News, working for you.